Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. This is a reaction to see the global impact of the sixth largest earthquake ever. So this happened yesterday, or at least I woke up yesterday seeing all this stuff about how there was going to be tsunamis hitting Hawaii and Japan. And then it went from that to California. And I've not seen anything about California being hit. So unless the tsunamis just aren't going to happen, which obviously fingers crossed that doesn't happen because they can be so devastating. But I know when it happens, like when it comes to like earthquakes, especially this powerful, it can lead to, yeah, tragic events after that like, cause tsunamis, etc. But I've not really seen much about this since I just woke up to the news yesterday, and it was like massive. It was all over my my Twitter feed. Um, but yeah, I don't know in what region within Russia it was. I assume it was the east side of the country, which is obviously a lot less populated, but. The sixth strong of it, strongest earthquake ever is pretty insane. Like, I mean, I don't know what in terms of like loss of life and stuff, but like, I'm just imagine. I've seen videos of like earthquakes, say like, on like compilations or just like you see footage online, and they always look crazy. But to have the sixth strongest one, I assume this looked like mental. But I haven't seen anything relating to it. I haven't even really looked into the news of it because I was just sort of waiting to see what happens um, in Hawaii. And thank God nothing happened. But the fear was there. And then it moved to California. I don't know if it's just because California's... It takes it will take a long time for it to get to California. Or if it's now just sort of got to the point where the tsunami isn't really a worry. But yeah, we're going to jump into this and check this out. Um, and see what really went on. One of the strongest earthquakes ever recorded struck off the Russian east coast a few hours ago. Oh, damn. Oh, shit. Look at all the seals. The rocks falling down as well. This is a, the largest earthquake we've had in over a decade worldwide. Wow. And so, and it's among the top uh, 10 earthquakes that have been measured by humans in the last century and a half. And so it's, it's quite a large earthquake. What happens is that close by the earthquake and on the coastline of, of, of Kamchatka, the tsunami was probably quite enormous. And Oh, so there was tsunamis just in Russia and then they obviously predicted they would also hit other regions as well. Damaging. That is mad that it could hit this region in Russia and then it can travel all the way to California. I find that mental. But, uh, the coastline itself is very sparsely populated. The main city in Kamchatka, it, about 150,000 people, is actually in a, in a harbor that's somewhat protected from that. Uh, but when the wave that set up there, again, this earthquake basically moves the seafloor upward by roughly a meter, a few feet, something like that. And that leads to a bulge of water that starts traveling across the ocean. Jeez. Okay, so it has hit regions. It's just not the regions that have been sort of all over the news. I assume not many people live here, but I don't know. Tsunami alerts in force for millions throughout the Pacific region. The tsunami threat triggered by a massive 8.8 .8 <coughs> magnitude quake that struck Russia's far east hours ago. The first waves hitting Russia and Japan where nearly Two million people have been evacuated. This is video wow. from Japan's second Two biggest island, people. Hokkaido, where people fled to the... Has this person not got a head? <laughs> what the fuck is going on here? This person's not got a head. Wait, what? I'm so confused. What is this? What's this? This island... Hokkaido, where people fled to the highest rooftops that they could oh, find. Oh, they've got a hat on, I think. A really white hat. Bro, I was like, what's going on? A mega thrust earthquake. It happens in a subduction zone. A tectonic plate is going under another, and part of the, the surface of the ocean is thrust up. Think of a continental plate being thrust up, and it's the push of water from down below that creates the tsunami. There's a lot of energy being pushed out. Now, if you are standing on a boat in the middle of the Pacific Ocean, you might not even notice. We are getting some pretty remarkable images uh, from where this earthquake struck uh, when it first struck uh, off the far east coast of Russia. At the time, 
this happened. Whoa, in surgery, that is fucked. That is absolutely crazy. He's having to hold it together. Uh, doctors in a cancer center were performing a surgery. That is so crazy. I've never seen anything like this in my life. And had to basically hold the patient, as you see there, hold on to the equipment in the operating room as well as steady themselves. Just an indication of how dramatic this was. Wow. He's dead. Over in Hawaii, there was a lot of chaos in the hours leading up to the waves coming ashore there where there was flooding and there were waves almost to six feet high. And uh, as they told people to evacuate, there was a log jam of traffic as people were trying to make their way up to higher elevations, up to buildings, four stories or higher. Here in Southern California, officials are the most concerned about the current. They're asking people here in LA County to stay out of the water. They're clearing the beaches. They've cleared all the events. They're asking RVs to move because yes, there wasn't any significant damage here. There wasn't any flooding, which is great news, but these waves are strong. I wanna take you to Russia. Oh, it caused volcanoes to erupt where a volcano in this general proximity of this earthquake zone is now erupting. We've seen images of lava oozing from the side of the volcano. Authorities have reported explosions. In fact, there are some tourists in the area who said they want to stay to watch the eruption. So that is all taking place as this earthquake uh, struck this far east coast of... Wait, so this is... Um Okay, let's just now Tsunami California. Because, again, I assume... Oh, they're cancelled. So, how can such a strong um, earthquake cause all of this and then it just happens to not really cause anything? It caused a few floods. Is it just luck? Is it just chance? Because it was everywhere. Uh, I mean, thank God, obviously, but there we go. That, I mean, that's all I've really seen of this earthquake, but <coughs> it makes you realize, like, I mean, just how close you could be to, a, like, a full-on disaster in this sort of situation. Well, that's crazy. Release the files. <laughs> she said, that's intense. Prayers for all of those who are impacted. About the files, though. Damn, everyone's just talking about the files. This comment section did not disappoint. Scary as hell, release the files. I love this, bro. People are not letting letting that go. That makes me so happy. About the Epstein files, man. It's not the sixth largest earthquake ever. I would be surprised if it's even um, one of the 6,000 largest earthquakes ever. It's only the sixth, sixth largest since we started measuring them. I mean, yeah, that's a fair point, but still. Imagine what the strongest ever earthquake that's not been recorded was, though. That must have been a crazy fucking thing. Um, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this reaction and until next time, like, subscribe and peace.